Hello everybody, E here. Welcome back to Thursday Theories. Today we're talking about Stephen King's The Dead Zone. If you were hoping for a night shift review or breakdown, um, I won't be doing the short story collections. At the end of this series, after all 60 some odd books, um, 50 I think, uh, novels, um, I will be going through and picking out the stories that tie in the best to the Dark Tower. Um, let's go ahead and jump into this one though. So, The Dead Zone is Stephen King's seventh book. It is his fifth under his name, and no, I won't be doing the Bachmans until the end also. There's a reason for that, but we'll get there eventually. Um, the book focuses on Johnny Smith, and I'm going to start off with my review first, and then I'm going to do the tie-ins. Um, I don't think this book is ever as good as it is in the beginning. Um, and that's throughout the whole book. It just steadily, for me, it steadily gets worse and worse. Um, the opening is great, terrific. Uh, the carnival sections are great. As soon as Johnny gets his powers, I start to dislike the book. Um, the, the Frank Dodd stuff is cool. I like that all right. I mean, I've never been a huge serial killer story fan. And then it just completely goes off the rail, again, subjectively for me with the whole Greg uh, or George Stilson. Hang on, I forgot his name. Anywho, um, The Politician. Uh, I, I've never cared too much for this. I don't even care for the movie. And I love Christopher Walken. Anyways, so let's get into the connections to the Dark Tower. The whole reason why we're here. Um, first off, two things that plant this significantly, this book significantly in the Kingverse are two characters. You have Richard Dees of The Night Flyer, the short story The Night Flyer, um, who works for Inside View. Inside View is mentioned throughout the entire King lexicon. Um, it's the tabloid that's uh, the tabloid of the universe, if you want to call it. Then you have George Bannerman, our favorite sheriff. Well, I don't know, some of you guys might be Alan Pankborn fans. What's wrong with you? Uh, George, of course, dies in Cujo. But um, in this one, this is his first appearance, the first time he's mentioned. Now, as far as the Dark Tower connections, we have, once again, and I know, <laughs> know some of you kind of cr cringe at me when I, I say that it connects to the Tommyknockers, with the whole alien thing, but here's where I go more in depth with how I believe this works. Well, okay, so if the Tommy Knockers, if the alien craft poison the water or whatever, and there's some res residual um, psychic ability floating off of this thing, why doesn't everybody in Maine have psychic abilities or telekinesis or pyrokinesis or any of these things? The reason for that, I think, is explained in here, which is he has to have a head injury to be able to do what he does. Um, so, let's say Carrie White. Maybe she has a head, I mean, his, her mother was something else. Maybe she hit her in the head going too many times. Um, or a traumatic event, like a uh, like starting your menstrual, well, I don't know if it's traumatic, I'm not a girl that don't know, but um, it, I, 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 would, if, I would expect that all of a sudden if you start bleeding for no, for no apparent reason, that can be traumatic. And of course, the way they pick on her hardcore afterwards, that's another thing. So, there's my connection. I believe that this alien spacecraft that, that plopped down in Haven has been sending off residual effects. And some people have the ability, because of either brain trauma or any trauma whatsoever, that screws them up in the head. Of course, Johnny, I think Johnny ends up with a brain tumor at the end. I think that's in the epilogue. Um, so, that could have been it the whole time. You know, put... put Pushing on, pushing something out of the way to let the psychic vibes in. Anyways, tell me what you think down there in the comments below. So until next time, I have been E, you have been you. This has been a Dead Zone Thursday Theorist. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye.